Meet Shaz Ali, a self-professed IT freak, husband, father, and son, who also happens to be an entrepreneur. Shaz, though not receiving any formal higher education in business or information technology, has managed to follow his dreams and gain success in both areas. According to Shaz's mother, Iris, from a very young age, Shaz, along with his siblings, developed an interest in computers. This interest, Mrs. Ali says, only increased over time. He could break up a computer and make it back. Really? Uh, yes, all that he could do. If, he, 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 if you buy the computer in parts, he fix it. He f from what age? From eight, nine years up. Since that the father buy computer for them, the four of them, and they start work on computer all the time. And then everything like the computer in their head or something. But they're good. And then the siblings struck gold about a decade ago. Their first success being Guyana Palace, Guyana's first social network. And this is where Shaz met the love of his life. I created the site back in 2014, um, 2004. I created the site back in 2004. Um, I I used to run the site with my siblings, and then I. This is how I met my wife. Um, she was she was a frequent user of the website. Um, she then eventually we, this, we 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 meet right through the website. We link up, we went out to see each other. Then eventually we got married, um, and now we are together for like t nearly ten years. The couple now share two children: a girl, Shakira, and a boy, Shahid the more recent addition to the family. Becoming a father, Shaz says, changed his perspective on many things, including how he does business. But he insists his life is not all about business because spending time with his family is a priority for him. I travel a lot with my family. I like to go to a place, especially Disney World. It's like I have a lot of childhood, childhood dream places that I want to go. Disney World was one of them. I go there almost every year. And just like things like Wrestling, I grew up watching wrestling. I went to WrestleMania before. All my childhood um, dreams, I'm to try to finally get them to accomplish them. He also maintains a very strong relationship with his parents, who he says instilled a strong business ethic in him from very young. And his mother, too, has a very strong attachment to her firstborn. Tell them this is my baby. Uh, yeah, this is my, no, this is the biggest one, but I just tell them that he is my baby. So I can't leave him. Shaz also told us about his most recent development, the Jubilee Apps, which he says will give Guyanese near and far a chance to keep abreast with all the events planned for the anniversary and even order food locally. You could watch out pictures, you could follow the events, the next events, take part, um, socialize with other members who are using the app right in Guyana. And you could even order stuff right through the app and have it delivered to you. That includes food, Guyanese food especially, um, like crafts and, and, and arts and so on, anything to do with Guyana. However, if it seems like Shaz became an overnight success, he says there were many failures but he did not give up on himself or his country. There's a lot of potential in Guyana here. All you have to do is have a lot of patience and work towards the goal. I, every time I want something, I say I, I will get this someday and eventually I got it. Just work towards it. Don't ever give up. Don't ever give up. Because you said too, you had a lot of failures before. I had a lot of failures before. I and I, I pick myself stronger and keep going. Um, you must fail to to go ahead. You must lose sometime, and I learn from your mistakes to to keep going forward. And in the future, he is looking to further extend his business interests to the tourism and hospitality sector. But for now, he manages his small restaurant located in the Courtyard Mall and the family pharmacy with his mother. Delisha Fletcher, Newsroom.